Well, hi, my name is Jandell Crutchfield. I'm currently a tenure track assistant professor at the University of Mississippi, and I'm on the Tupelo campus. So I've been teaching with the university for three years, one year in Oxford and the last two here in Tupelo. Um, I'm in the Department of Social Work. I've previously been a social worker, and I think social workers should rule the world. So I primarily teach incoming juniors that are just entering the social work program, and then I teach seniors that are on their way out, um, about to graduate. So I teach them as well. I think all of my life I've been engaged in service. Um, and so service was modeled for me um, in my family, in my household. And so I was always keenly aware as a young person of those people who, who didn't have the set of circumstances that match mine. Um, and I always wonder why um, it seemed to impede them in terms of reaching the goals that they set. Um, and so I wanted to pursue a degree that would allow me to figure out how people cope, how people develop, why they think the way they do. And so I pursued psychology um, at Washington University in St. Louis. And it was during that time that I spent hours volunteering in the kindergarten classroom. Go figure, everybody goes to kindergarten. Um, and I was always um, drawn to those students who had their heads down or seemed not to be having a good day, um, didn't really know their ABCs or couldn't keep pace with everyone else. And I noticed that teachers, because I was originally interested in education, um, didn't necessarily have the freedoms to deal with or tackle the issues that children may be facing outside of the classroom. And I said, I wanted to be the person that would be able to address um, any of the issues that kids are dealing with at home and the community so that they can come to school and just be kids and just be able to, to listen to teachers and do what they're asked. Um, so out of all of the professions that were there, social work presented itself as one of the things that, um, one way that I could be able to do that. I knew I wanted to become a professor when I was able to touch the lives of individuals and families as a school social worker working in schools in Baton Rouge, but I could not necessarily address the systemic issues that my clients face in terms of access to resources, um, environmental health, uh, medical health, and so I wanted to be able to pursue a degree that would allow me to influence policy with research, and so I decided to pursue my PhD in social work at LSU. Right now I'm working on um, research regarding school social workers. So there are lots of different types of education reforms that happen and school social workers are kind of thrown into um, chaos sometimes when they don't really know what their roles are. So I'm exploring how school social workers figure out what their roles are, um, in particular in charter schools. There's some that are opening in Mississippi, but it's a new wave of reform. And so school social workers are trying to figure out what they're doing. Um, anecdotally, there actually are some school social workers that are leading in charter schools, so serving as administrators. Um, and so that's a diverse role. And so I'm exploring the experiences of school social workers and how they're able to be effective um, regarding different education reforms that happen. So that's one thing I'm excited about. Another is cultural competence. And I've actually presented several um, local workshops on how social workers can adapt to the changing culture that we have in our country. And so we always talk about 2020, things are going to be di different in terms of the makeup of society. Well, 2020 is three years away. And so we often train social workers on how to work cross-culturally with people that are different than themselves. And so I'm researching how social worker can do a better job of that, um, whether we're actually meeting the challenge of training our students to be able to work effectively with people that are different than them. And I'm particularly interested in skin color discrimination. So we talk about issues of race, issues of gender, issues of religion and sexuality, um, but skin color discrimination is actually something that's an international phenomenon. Um, across cultures, and so my research focuses on the job that social work is doing um, and incorporating that into our education. The students at the University of Mississippi Tupelo are the best students, bar none. 
uh, they bring with them such rich experiences. It makes the application of social work principles and ideals um, very easy to communicate. Um, so the diversity of their life experiences, of their different career experiences. Some of the students have worked in other professions and bring with them work experiences, family experiences. Um, the eagerness of the students at the University of Mississippi Tupelo um, is what I enjoy in the classroom. Um, their passion and commitment to social work um, and wanting to be the best that they can be. I actually mentor students as part of the school social work organization. And um, so without any extra credit or any type of compensation, they actually volunteer to try to make the Tupelo community better um, by serving uh, meals to those in need by collecting Christmas gifts for families in need. Um, so uh, I'm just really impressed by the passion of the students here and the diversity of their experiences. When I'm not on campus, I am spending most of my time with my five-year-old son and my three-year-old daughter, and they keep me going because of who they are. And so they actually help me to explore different things and to learn the city of Tupelo and all of the things that is offered in the community. One of my highlights in the last year is actually coaching my son's soccer team. I've never played soccer, didn't know anything about soccer, hadn't watched soccer, but uh, my son's team needed a coach. And so I rose to the challenge and I had a team of six little boys, aged four to six. And so we had a rump and stumping good time playing soccer and actually scored some goals and won a few games. Um, and so they're constantly um, encouraging me uh, to be able to explore different things than what is related to social work at all. Social workers are present in every sector of society. So if you think about healthcare, if you think about economics, if you think about education, if you think about policy, Congress, international studies, social workers touch all of those different sectors. And so if you want to do any of those, you can do that with a social work degree. So the best way for prospective students to contact me about social work is to send me an email at jmcrutch at olemiss.edu or to stop by my office. I'm in the office uh, Monday through Thursday, typically. I'm on campus teaching Tuesdays and Thursdays, so stopping in to sit in on a class. I don't mind if students, w or prospective students are interested in stopping in to visit a class, um, to ask me any questions during office hours on Tuesday, Thursday, or just to come by to see what social work is all about, to see what opportunities there are in terms of employment after you get a social work degree. Um, I'm interested in talking to anyone that's interested in social work.